For the second time in less than a year, CSUMB has opened its doors, or more like parking lots, to emergency crews responding to local natural disasters. Huge difference. Just being on a paved surface makes it really easy. There's a lot of space, so we have room for all the crew trucks to come in and park, and it's easy to get them fed and it's an easy in and easy out. Close to 125 crew members will be coming through this base camp at some point. And then dinner will be set up here. To refuel themselves and their trucks and get their next assignment for storm recovery. This is where we handle kind of all the, the random requests that come into the base camp. Um, primarily we're working on food uh, and fuel for the vehicles and then we help coordinate with the uh, materials people or across the way there. It was the same site in July and August after the Sobranes fire engulfed the Big Sur community. I was out here for Sobranes um, and the coverage for the fires uh, and having this site available to us has really uh, allowed us to act a lot faster uh, in the restoration processes. Rain or shine, whatever mother nature throws at us next, emergency responders know they have a home at CSUMB. It's really nice that there's more than enough room for, for us here. And when we were here for the Sobranes fire, it was, it was a great place for us to set up.